nabit is one of the popular word in it industry that is nothing but chat gpt everyone talking about chat gpt in these days now let us talk about what are the primary differences between google and chat gpt yes there are a lot of differences are there between google and chat gpt but i am going to explore the primary and most important differences between google and chat gpt so without wasting our time let us start the main topic what are the main differences between google and chat gpt so google is a search engine it helps us to find information any type of information not only text based information so not only text based information it provides a variety of information like uh, uh, images audio video voice process every kind of information you can get easily from google whereas chat gpt is a model language or artificial intelligence language but you can expect output in the format of text based only text based only only you can get the output in the format of text based as of now the second main difference is you can give input as a text or voice assistant or image search or etc okay so you can give in different types of input to google so you can give different types of inputs to get the information what we are expecting whereas in chat gpt you can give input only text based only okay so you cannot give input as a voice or image search like this as of now okay and third main difference is in google we are using complex algorithms and techniques to filter the data or to get the exact relevant data so whenever we are giving any query or task google using complex algorithms and techniques to get relevant data whereas chat gpt is using machine learning algorithms and some natural language you can receive the data like human is replying to your queries and next main difference is you will have only less interactivity with google search engine you are requesting some tasks or questions to the google search engine there is some less interactivity is there you can ask your query to the google through text based or voice based voice assistant okay only some less interactivity is there whereas with chat gpt your interaction is very high guys it feels like i am conversation with some other opposite person so chat gpt can give a quick response that to in the layman words you can easily understand whatever task you are giving you are you can easily understand that answer or that response and next difference is you may have doubt where this google or chat gpt can get the data what is the main data source so whenever you are asking a request to the google search engine or chat gpt from where this softwares are getting data so you may have doubt so if you are using google search engine you can get the data from different or number of web pages here chat gpt get the data based on the machine trained on next major difference is everyone can access google search engine okay not only employees are not only some professional persons everyone even non technical candidates also can easily access google search engine but for chat gpt some limitations are there to access the chat gpt if you are a professional or employable person you can easily understand you can easily access the chat gpt because nowadays chat gpt introduced some pro version as well that means so you have to pay some amount to use chat gpt so for monthly uh, some amount you have to pay but google search engine is it's a completely free of cost you can the next major difference is you can access google through web browser and mobile apps only okay you can access the google to find any information to search any information you have to use either web browser or mobile app 
whereas chat gpt is used in various or different platforms including chatbot virtual assistant customer services okay if you are integrated this chat gpt with api then you can use this chat gpt on different platforms so like this there are number of differences are there between google and chat gpt you may have doubt so which one is good and which one is better uh, for programmers or developers see friends both technologies are high demand nowadays okay and each individual has their pros and cons but my recommendation is as of now you can use google only okay for better results so that's all guys mind i hope this information is very helpful so if you really love this content then don't forget to hit the like button and also don't forget to share to your friends as well so we'll meet with one more useful content video thank you very much